have there, Wendy? It's a safety harness, Roly. I'm going to use it when Scoop and Lofty help me replace some rich tiles on Mrs. Broadbent's roof. Oh, yeah! Rock and roll! Muck and I have to go over to JJ's to pick up a special fireplace for Mrs. Percival. She wants to replace the one in her living room with an antique one. What's an anti... A anti... Uh, thingamajig, Bob? <laughs> antique, Dizzy. An antique is something that's very old and valuable. We really should be going now, Bob. You're right, Wendy. Come on, everybody! Can we fix it? Yes, we can! Uh, yeah, I think so. Hey, Bob! What was that? It looked like a model airplane. She's a beauty, Bob. She's an XV-7 single-engine remote-controlled stunt plane. Hey, watch this. <laughs> wow! That's fantastic, JJ! Thanks, Muck. I'm gonna take her out for a real test flight this morning. Now, where on earth is Trix without fireplace? Here I am, JJ. You can give the fireplace to me now, Trix. Okie dokie, Muck. Would you maybe like to try out my plane later, Bob? Oh, that'd be great, JJ. I'll come over after I finished at Mrs. Percival's. Okay, Muck, we better get a move on. Bye, JJ. Bye, Trix. Hmm. Now, where has that plane Whoa! Hello, Mrs. Percival. We have your antique fireplace. So I see, Bob. And it's magnificent. Now, let's take a look at your old fireplace. Oh, yes. I'll have this out in no time. Um, I've covered the carpet and furniture. You will be careful not to make too much mess, won't you, Bob? Fireplaces can be such... such dirty things. Of course, Mrs. Percival. Now stand back. Okay, little plane. Let's see what you can do. The birds are eating the seed again, Spud. Go and scare them away, Spud. Well, that's easy for Farmer Pickles to say, but being a scarecrow is hard work. Ah. Oh, oh, -ho. what's that? Could it be? It looks like it is an airplane. Ew. I'm Spud the pilot. <laughs> Oh, I was sure it came down around here somewhere. Oh, oh. <laughs> what's this? Aha! Now, what does it... Oh, oh, oh. Hey, hey, oh, oh. <laughs> Spot the pilots at the controls, cruising at 20 zillion feet. Ladies and gentlemen, we will be experiencing turbulence. <laughs> oh, that was the idea. <laughs> Uh, I'm the world's first scarecrow pilot. <laughs> Got you now, Squawk. <laughs> oh, no. No. Watch out, Squawk. I'll get you this time. Oh. Hey, come back. Come back. <laughs> There you are, Mrs. Percival. All ready to fit the new fireplace. And you've made hardly any mess. Well done, Bob. Stop! Ah, must be around here somewhere. Huh? Stop that plane! Hey, 
Hey, Spud! Stop! That's my aeroplane! Mamma mia! That was a fast! Oh, where did that come from? Oh my goodness, did you see that? Aha! Uh -huh. You know, that kind of looks like an XV-77 single-engine remote-controlled stunt aircraft. Uh, uh, oh, oh, is anybody seen uh, an airplane? It, it went, went that way. way! Thanks! Come back! This is your pilot speaking! Okay, Lofty, lower away. Hey, Wendy, look! What's that, Scoop? Oh, phew! That was close. Where on earth did that come from? <laughs> Out of my way! No! no! It's all right, Lofty. It was only Spud. Oh, 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 oh. It's all right. It's a only Spud. Only Spud. Where did the plane come from, Wendy? I don't know, Scoop. But I'll bet Spud has something to do with it. There you are, Mrs. Percival. Finished. Thank you so much, Bob. It's lovely. And no mess. Now I can take the covers off my furniture. <laughs> oh, phew. I thought it was going to go on forever. <laughs> uh oh. No! <laughs> Oh, oh my goodness. What's going on? What's what going happened? On? I can't see a thing. This looks like JJ's aeroplane. Or what's left of it. Look what it's done to my living room. I'm going to have a word with JJ. Or whoever owns that aeroplane. Spud? Do you know anything about this, Spud? This? Me? Um, no. Uh, well... Not, not exactly. Spud? Oh. Oh, I'm sorry, Mrs. Percival. I'm sorry, Bob. I found it in this field, see? And I tried to scare a squawk, and then a log got in the way, and, and then it all went wrong. Oh, caught up with you at last. Oh. Hello, JJ. Is this your airplane? Oh, Bob. Thank goodness. Oh, but what's happened to the wings? Um... I think they're still up there, JJ. Oh, Spud! Just because you find something in a field, it doesn't mean that it's yours to play with. Look at the trouble you've caused. Yes, Mrs. Percival. Sorry, Mrs. Percival. I'll call Wendy and get her to bring over the long ladder. We'll rescue the wings, and then I can fix your plane. Really, Bob? Oh, that'd be great. And what about the mess in my living room? Hmm... I think I know someone who can help you with that, Mrs. Percival. Good idea, Bob. Someone should help her with that. Uh oh. Yeah. Me, Bob. Okay, Bob. Spots on the job, Bob. There you go, JJ. Good as new. Thanks, Bob. You'll have her flying again in no time. <laughs> yes. I wonder how our other pilot is doing. Wow! This is Duster One coming in to land! You'll have to do better than that, Spud. Oh! I bet real pilots don't have to dust! <laughs> <laughs>